Big tiger. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Been stuck in isolation for the past few days uh, with the flu, but it's given me a bit of time to put together some footage of a recent dive trip that I did with a couple of mates up at 1770. Uh, we dove the bunker group. We took my mate Reese's Haynes Hunter uh, 17R up uh, and dove off that and spent a night on it out at the reef. We had pretty much perfect weather and clean blue water. We got some really good fish and saw some big sharks. If you do enjoy the video, please consider subscribing for more. Cheers. After a seven hour drive, we arrived at 1770 at about 1 a.m. After a couple hours sleep near the boat ramp, we headed out at first light and began the 60 kilometer journey out to the reef. The sun is risen. We were keen to get in the water, so we sounded up some ground in about 20 meters of water, which looked really promising. The sounder was showing some good sign of fish and there was a bit of current, so we decided to jump in and do a few drifts. First fish of the trip, little genius Joey. Trout. <laughs> That's a cracker. Within a few dives, we all managed to get some nice coral trout and green job fish, which must have piqued the curiosity of a large three meter plus tiger shark, which cruised in on us. At first, the shark just seemed curious. I swam after it to get a closer look and get some footage, but we soon realized it wasn't showing any signs of leaving. And judging by its body language, it was a bit too interested in us. So we decided to leave it be and move spots. What do you think, Ma? Oh, it's not good showing you, Ma. <laughs> We didn't feel much for the remainder of the first day, but we all managed to bag a few more fish each. With the sun starting to set, we anchored up in one of the lagoons, cooked some dinner, had a couple beers, and got some sleep. Keen to see what the next day had in store for us. Cheers.
We were up early the next morning, keen to fill the esky with some more fish. We got our wetsuits back on and sounded up a few spots that looked promising. We couldn't have really had any better conditions. There was only a breath of wind, no swell, and beautiful, clean blue water. As the day progressed and a few more fish in the bag, all of a sudden we had another surprise visit from a tiger shark. This one was a bit smaller than the first but seemed a bit more relaxed and more inquisitive. It checked us out a few times but didn't feel threatening at all. It was such an unreal experience. You can hear that there was whales singing in the background. We dove a couple more spots and got some more fish, but with the day coming to an end and the esky pretty much full, we decided to call it and head back home. Oh, the Spaniard, she, she's not gonna fit in there. Good trip, eh? Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I just want to mention on here quickly, uh, Reese, whose boat we were diving off, he owns Salty Backs and makes fully custom carbon fins. Uh, so if you're in the market looking for a new pair of fins, I'll leave his website 
uh, link in the description below. He makes all these fins right here on the Gold Coast, so they're all local, locally owned. Um, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed that video, and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.